Public housing is really important for Washington, D.C. because it's a city that has lost truly affordable housing. Public housing is actually the last vestige of real affordable housing in the district. People pay 30% of their income. If you have a disability, if you're unable to work, uh, usually most people will have a zero rent. We are working with public housing residents who are the leaders, who have the lived experience and know the solutions to build power for them, to be able to support them in identifying the issues and building strong campaigns so they can push their demands forward. The main problem with public housing is that there is no accountability. It has been neglected by every administration for years. It only becomes relevant when there is a sale or they're trying to revitalize. DC Housing Authority should respond just like any other landlord when there are problems and things need to be done. I'm a single mom, so like I can't afford to live where I want to live. Uh, public houses is supposed to be for people that have low income, that needs it, that it's hard to live in DC, it's expensive, and we just need help. We just need a little help. What I think is needed to improve public housing, just listen to the residents, care about them more, fix the problems that we need to be fixed. Be able to have the knowledge to speak out and just know that like, your voice being heard, it really helps. So I just feel like they should have more programs and processes in place to help people. They should have people who want to help people. My experience working with Empower DC is awesome. So to know that there is an organization that's here to help, to hear help advocate with us, to listen to us, to understand, to try to help us find solutions and to help us get our voices out there. I'm very, very grateful and thankful for you guys. In order to improve um, public housing, you should come directly to the residents and ask them their concerns. Empower DC has gave me the tools and helped me rally up my residents and um, keep in communication with the residents at Berry Farm. The trick is to put you in bondage where you have to go by their rules and they don't listen to the residents. Like I said, they need to monitor the people that they are running these sites. All they see is dollar signs and land. What public housing residents see are communities. They see where they've grown up, where their neighbors, their families lived, where their history is. So we want to make sure that we are able to preserve that 